Not a day goes by that I do not pause to look at the natural environment that surrounds us. Nature plays such a big role in answering the unknown. How is this complexity possible? I think we have a lot to learn from their diversity and adaptation. The best way to understand our own biology is to look at the biology that's present in nature. Why? Because we are inextricably linked to every species that is found on this planet. When I see these organisms, I see untapped potential. Biologists are very interested in understanding how life operates. We produce a number of hypotheses and theories and diagrams to explain that complexity. But all that complexity fails in comparison to what these animals display to us on a daily basis. What we like to find in nature are organisms that exaggerate a given attribute. Why can planaria regenerate and humans can't? How can zebrafish regenerate their hair cells? We have hair cells in our inner ear that cannot regenerate, so later in life we may lose our hearing. So what is the molecular and genetic basis for that? Those are the types of questions that we hope these organisms can address. In the next 10 years, a total of 10.8 million genomes will be sequenced, and that sequencing information will ultimately demonstrate how closely related we are to each other. And it is truly remarkable to think about why it worked out that way. We have models that can be found under a rock in a creek or out in the ocean. And where else can you say that you have these animals right in front of you in the same building that you can do this work. It's just, it, it doesn't happen in a whole lot of places across the globe.